is? He's only... He's not even... Even close to being... Aged. Land tortoise and different eats discarded fruit. Well, yeah. Devo has been in our family since before the name meant anything. You know what? You gotta stay here, dude, because you last at least 120 years. Long live the land turtle! Yeah, that's how I'm gonna put it. Long live the land... Oops. Not lad. Land tor... Toys. Okay, awesome. What else we got? <gasps> uh, goldfish are useless. 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 Let's straight into the desk. Yeah. What do we got? Ah, oh, parrot unforgiving bites other animals. Damn thing squawks. It doesn't stop. I haven't slept through the night in four years. Well then, sorry, bird. Too loud. No sleep. That's how we do things, right? Yeah, straighten it up, and the old boss man will be mad. I got rid of Alan. I got rid of Alan. Well, I think I speak for all of us when I say documentaries are great. Yeah, I just watched one. Documentaries are important government tools. Okay. They show the public that we're just like them. Okay. My favorite documentary is... Um... Well, well I forget the title. But it's about a wolf raised by geese. Okay. The wolf grows up and eats the geese. I imagine... No, if he's raised by them, he would eat them. It's a message we can all learn from. In any case, there's a reason I'm bringing this up. Believe it or not, they're making a documentary about this department. What? Nah, we ain't that special. So in order to present us all in a best possible light, I'm asking you, well, telling you actually, I'm telling you to approve all your animals today. Understood? Yeah, I guess. Good. Great. Um, oh, an announcement before you start your day. It seems that Alan is no longer with us. Everything's fine, but... Uh, well, there was an issue in the cages. Just a slight mix-up. It's, uh... It's nothing too much to worry about. But, well, that's what's going on. He was a good employee. Yeah, sure. A good boy. You're, okay. You'll be missed. Alright. Oh, dear. What could have happened to Alan? I got rid of him. I got rid of Alan. I rejected him. Rejected. <laughs> I did. I did not like him much. Well, that's why he is gone. But this is very concerning. Nope. Dear, I told you I had heard bad things about that place. Yep. I hope the boss does not ask me to go there. I'm sure he won't. They're making a documentary about us. I'm a little worn down, dear. This documentary will be very exciting, though, I think. Well, yeah, you get to approve all the animals. To be honest, I'm very happy about it. It means we do not have to reject any animals. See? I will tell you, though. I'm getting a little worried about my cats. But cats can take care of themselves. They have not come up for inspection yet. Uh-oh. I'm very anxious. I just want them to be okay. Dear, we need to talk. We are talking. That cat you rejected, I know is an outside cat. And I know there are many prejudices against such cats. There's no, he can take care of himself. But dear... All cats should be seen as equals. Okay. No cat is better than any other. Okie dokie. Even if a cat is mostly outside and gets very dirty, it had nothing about him getting dirty. He can take care of himself. A cat is still worth loving. I agree. I hope you understand. I do. Ugh. 
It's a tiny dog, but it's respectful and good to talk to. Mike don't walk so well, but he gets by. My freaking ass crack hurts. <laughs> I'm sorry, but this chair is really digging in my butt. Alright, well, I have to approve all the animals today because that documentary. So, um... Walks with a cute little limp. We'll make him sound uh, cuter than he looks. Oh my gosh, look at that cat. Feline, nice, comforting. Nice cat, I'd say. Yeah, he looks nice. Yeah, he does. Nice cat. Oh, it's a fish. Fish, Bruni, food for snakes. I don't care, everything here is a feeder. Okay, approved! Yes! Approved for feeding the animals. Yes, yes. Alright, let's see what else we got. Uh, that bird isn't sleeping. But I have to approve everything. I'm gonna say nice sleeping birdie. Oh, I better just say bird because, you know, words and whatnot. Oh, look at that doggy. Pup, intense, strong willed. She smells pretty bad, but I refuse to, cl I refuse to clean her. Any decent animal should be self sustaining. Dogs need help. But that's okay. Cats need help. Look at milk. But milk doesn't need help anymore. And if, I don't know. It was the food or something. I don't know. He didn't want to touch his butt. But now he does. Let's see. Um, smells bad. Yeah. Awesome. Let's file it. All right. Well, the day is come and gone. That's a uh, doc day, by the way. <laughs> documentary day because they were filming a documentary I get it and documentary starts with a D dude I get it okay well anyways I have good news and bad news good news is that the family went well they got all the shots they needed they're done with this office bad news is that we're now extremely behind on our rejection quotas so, um, I'm going to need you all to reject everything today. No exceptions. Oh, goodness. I thought things were getting better around here. Yesterday was so nice, but today will be awful. I'm not sure I could do it. Maybe all of our animals will be bad today. That is possible, right, dear? Yes, it's quite possible. Yes, it might be what happens. Only bad animals today. Yeah, like that dead bird. Nice dog. You know what? That guy can kiss my white ass. This dog is is being approved. Why? Because it's a beautiful. Oh, I better have kept it. Beautiful doggy. Let's see. Oh, it's a basic dog. It's forgetful. One time she barked at a rock. What? What? You know what? That is the best thing ever is when you see dogs do that. They're like barking at inanimate objects for no reason. My cat, the other day, he dicky, attacked my bra because it accidentally moved because it caught on my foot. And he literally just, just spat at it. <laughs> he was attacking it. It was funny. Yes, keep it. You mean this kitty right here? Oh, is he up there? Hi, kitty. Oh, is he behind me? He's such a good boy. What's he doing? Oh, he's such a good boy. Why would he do? Barking at rocks is cool. Right on. 
Ooh, that cat looks... Cat. Meek. Medicinal properties. What? This cat's my baby. I just love her so much. This cat is old and needs to be put down, ma'am. <gasps> Whose cat is that? <laughs> oh, no! <gasps> I bet it's the great lady's cat. Oh no. Oh, I am an awful person. I am so sorry. Uh, but but this this cat is already one foot in the grave. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Who cares about I'm sorry. I do not. It's rude. Rude fish. I don't know. If... Well, he's, he's a piranha. Oh, it's a goldfish. Fish, cheerful. This place is water. The local fish. The boys get a real kick out of him. Alrighty. A... Stupid fish. Fish. Yes. Oh my god, now I gotta face Martha. Oh, she's gonna be so mad at me. My mother had a saying. Hang in there. Well, and the poster, like, with the monkey on it? Isn't there one with the monkey swinging by his... Oh, I'm sorry. I don't think she made it up. But she sure said it a lot. Um... I guess what I'm trying to say is, I know things are rough, but remember to hang in there. Yeah. Um, that being said, Mindy is sick again. Good, good old Mindy. I don't know who Mindy is. She's really been sick a lot recently. Suspicious. Sorry. <laughs> Alright, well, Alan took over last time, and, um, well, he's not with us anymore. Yeah, because I kicked him up. So it's your turn. Ah, oh, shit. You'll take over from Mindy today. Just head down to the cages. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll follow you down a bit with instructions. Fine. You... What, what didn't you understand? Is it really so hard to just re reject everything? Oh, that's why you're putting me in cages? Shut your mouth. There's nothing to think about. You just stamp the forms with the red stamp. You you look at a form. And you say, Okay, this, this is a form. And it has an animal on it. And my boss told me to reject every animal. And then you stamp it. You're a model of incompetence. You are lick my. Never mind. What were you gonna say? You were gonna say lick my ball. Uh, no, I was not. But I can maybe understand if you had an agenda. I do have an agenda. But honestly, um. Well, your moral compass is all over the place. And as far as I know, the magnetic fields inside this office are pretty normal. Yes, because you are certainly normal, my friend. You can expect a strike for this. Aw, this is only your first strike, so don't worry too much. But if you get three, you're done. Well, I'm already done. I'm in the cages. Ah, crap. Hello, great lady. Sorry about your cat. Dear, I know you're really doing your job, but I just can't look at you right now. You could have saved her. I didn't know it was your fucking cat. Yes, you did. It was a lot to ask of you, but I still hoped. Welcome to the cages. Yes, because it looks different. You're probably wondering where all the actual cages are. No, but the music has changed. Well, rest assured, there are definitely some cages in here. Invisible cages. But they're behind a few more doors. You'll see them soon, I bet.
but first, I'm sure you have a few questions. I'm sure I probably would have already kicked you in the balls and left by now. Maybe you want to ask what this place is. Yes, well, we'll ask. Yes, I thought so. Well, I'll tell you. You've been part of a little experiment. I bet. Is it a government experiment against animals? Hey, Milky, come here. Well, come here, boy. Come here, boy. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. You should be here for this. Yeah. Yeah, I should go, boy. Okay. Well, I guess it's more of a big experiment. But anyways, I have a few questions for you. Here, Milk, will you answer the questions for me, buddy? Huh? Yeah. Oh, you can't get a, you can't get on the table, buddy. That's not good. You want down? You can get down if you want. Then I'll explain everything. Please try to answer as honestly as possible. I will. G That's my policy. Um. First question. Have you noticed anything out of during your time here? Yes, sir. I have. Hmm. In Interesting. Next question. Is the goal of this organization to clear to you? Mm, not really. Alright, let me just mark that down. Third question. Would you describe everyone here as normal? No. Ah. Would you describe Martha as abnormal? No. Hmm. What about me? You're weird. Rude. I did ask, though. Yeah, you did. You told me to be honest. Hmm. Well. I think we're just about done here. Thanks very much for your time. So, I guess you noticed there's something funny going on. Well, I'll explain a few things. So, first of all, Alan. Rest in peace. Alan wasn't a real person. What I mean by that is that Alan wasn't always the way he was. The Alan you were interacting with was actually an animal. An animal? Holy cow! Alright. A dog, specifically. Well, his thing had a frog on it. Neat, right? Cool, neat. Yeah. Hell yeah, it is. Anyways, look. We've been researching how to train animals to do manual labor. Like your job. Stamping forms. We can train animals to do it. Of course, to do that, we have to set them up with nicer brains. Oh, I see where you're going with us. And we need... We seed those brains with human memories. So they can actually function. In Alan's case, we gave him Alan's memories. Alan, the, the dog's case. We gave the dog Alan the memories of the human Alan. Alright, it's getting a little complicated. Not the dog Alan's name was originally Alan too. Okay. I mean, that would be weird coincidence. Yeah, what a quinky dink. Anyways. When you have someone's memories, you kind of freak out if you don't actually look like them. So then we make that happen. Look, I won't get into the specifics. Well, you're doing a damn good job. But like technology, pretty advanced these days. So we can basically make an animal pass as human. And we don't have to pay them. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna say the joke I want to say. <laughs> you know so all these pets we've been rejecting nope they're an untapped workforce and we're tapping them of course and you did notice something was off so we still have some work to do but yeah it makes sense yep great I'm glad but one more thing real quick you have a dog right and I'm guessing that's why you started working here? Yes. Yeah, I thought so. That dog's been recommended for immediate rejection. I did that. It wasn't a very good dog. Sorry, but that's just the way things go. I guess I did it to Martha's cat, huh? 
I can't really give special treatment to my employees. That wouldn't be very ethical. Yeah, and what you're doing is very ethical, right? And frankly, I really don't like you that much. I don't like you. You weren't a very good worker. I think I was a fine worker. Douche. Anyways, that's it. You're such a blue waffle. Yeah, I know. Just wanted to let you know personally. See you tomorrow. <gasps> oh, not my puppy. Oh, no. Game over. You lose. No, I'm sad. That's okay. We're going to watch the doctor. I'm going to tweet it. Link Twitter. No, I don't want to. Alright, well, I'm done. I'm done. This game's pretty cool. So what happened was, is that um, I wanted to start playing computer games um, along with console games. And I saw the fabulous Krusty play it. He's a cool dude, by the way. You should go check out his, uh, his channel. And I thought, well, let me start off small. So I wanted to start off with this. And I actually found it for the Mac. Because apparently my Mac... If you have a Mac, you know how hard it is sometimes to get any of these games. But without having to pay or pay a lot of money for them. So got it for free. It was awesome. I'll, when I export it to YouTube, I will put a link in the description. So you can get it too for Mac or for PC. And if you liked it... Awesome, like it, share, subscribe. If you're on my Twitter, or you just, or not my Twitter, if you came on my Twitch and you like my Twitch, follow me. Awesome, we'll see you later. Bye guys.